Wow, the uh, BBC's. That's board, cool. Huh? Wow. And we were thinking what he must have thought when he said, you're going to go to Vigo County. Where am I going? In Indiana. Go yeah. figure it out. To a grocery store where they're going to vote. <laughs> yes. Tim, we're glad what? to have what? you, though. You're going daft, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Is that good? That wasn't good. That, that was not bad. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. <laughs> You're just getting started. It's going to be yeah, a long just, night. <laughs> yeah, it is. We're gonna dig night. in. It was a dreary primary day for most of us. We were dodging showers and a few pockets of drizzle. What we have left of the rain on live Doppler 13 radar is in our far eastern viewing area. And this continues to move out across the southeastern part of the state. You can see over the last couple of hours the showers that move through Columbus and Greensburg and Westport. Speaking of Greensburg, still cloudy at this hour, but we go from Greensburg to oh. Oh, lots of sunshine in Kokomo, live from the SkyTrack 13 Weather Bug Network, really showing the difference from south to north across the state, where we have clouds in 57 in Greensburg, but sunshine in 64 in Kokomo right now. 62 degrees in Indianapolis, Crawfordsville, and Lafayette. We'll be in the low 60s for the first pitch at Victory Field, Indianapolis Indians, 7.05 this evening. Temperatures will be in the upper 50s and low 60s from the beginning of the game through the ninth inning. And we are forecasting mainly dry conditions over the next few hours. That changes after midnight. Developing cold front will arrive first thing tomorrow morning. It will impact the Wednesday morning commute with rain and maybe a couple of thunderstorms storms. Early morning temperatures close to 50. Keep the umbrellas handy all day long. 54 by noon. High temperatures tomorrow will struggle only in the mid 50s. Once the cold front passes to our east, we will focus on instability. Showers and thunderstorms rebuilding with peak heating tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening. That's when we could have some hail producing thunderstorms across central Indiana. We will cover that for you when and if those do develop tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening. We're going to go from cold to warm in a matter of a few days. And if you're running or volunteering or cheering somebody on for the mini marathon, start temperature near 55 degrees, but it's going to warm up quickly. So be prepared for that as you start to plan for the mini on Saturday. Temperatures will climb into the mid 60s by 9 a.m. into the mid 70s by noon. It's going to be a fast warm up. We'll get all the way to 82 on Saturday afternoon. Rain and storms tomorrow. Some hail producing thunderstorms start the day at 48 and the day at 56. Patchy frost will be possible by Friday morning as we drop to 38 degrees. After 58 on Thursday, we get to 72 on Friday. There's the 82 for Saturday. Late day storms Saturday, but we have Mother's Day drive for now and mild with a high of 70.